Hey, Gracie here. Today we're gonna to talk all about styling your home with houseplants. Houseplants have so many benefits. They clean the air, help keep you healthy, and are great for adding some flair to your indoor spaces. Decorating with houseplants is a really fun way to add texture, color, and vertical interest to your indoor designs. I want to show you some great ways to style your home with houseplants. The entryway is the first place guests see when they walk in the door, so why not make a great first impression? I love the look of this Chinese evergreen here and its rattan plant holder. This is actually a plant stand that I turned upside down. Makes for a great bohemian feel, which is definitely my style. So don't be afraid to get creative. The ZZ plant is also another great option because it will pretty much grow anywhere and it has these really great rich glossy green leaves. Speaking of plant stands, English Gardens has a huge selection to choose from, from metal to wicker to wood and beyond. You're bound to find something to fit your style. Plant stands are an excellent way to feature your plants and add an artsy element to your room. This modern matte pink plant stand is one of my favorites and I think the pothos looks so great in it. Plus, this guy loves to trail, so something with height is ideal for him. Another great way to incorporate plants into your decor, try utilizing your bookshelves, built-ins, or even wall space to feature plants. My funky checkered pot and my Swiss cheese plant fit in perfectly with my other decor on my shelf. And you might have an area with a lot of open space, like the top of my bookshelf. Think of adding more height in those places and mix in some of your existing decor. These candlesticks were a great way to add dimension, fill in space, and highlight these unique plants, which I picked out for their color and fun textures. They're like art all on their own. And another unexpected way to display plants are these gorgeous macrame wall hangers. You're probably familiar with macrame that hangs from the ceiling, but this option actually hangs against the wall. And I have a big gallery wall in my house, and it was fun to incorporate these into my existing layout. Plus, you can choose your own containers like this classic white or marble design and choose your own plants. I went with two of my favorites, the Maranta and the Ficus. One tip for these, be sure to get a container with an attached saucer to catch any excess water. Now, you've heard me say it before, but containers are probably the simplest way to bring your style to life. And English Gardens has an amazing selection to choose from. If you're looking to go with that bohemian look, this woven basket planter will fit in perfectly. And the Dracaena here really draws the eye with its distinct trunk and the airy full look at the top. But a snake plant or even a monstera would look great in there too. Now for a more modern look, there are so many unique painted ceramic pots to choose from with different colors and designs. This container here really helps to highlight these beautiful pink tones at the center of my bromeliad. And another great option for easy decor, check out English Garden's combination pots featuring succulents, tropicals, and more. You can find the perfect mix for you. A few examples are behind me. Succulents are super easy to care for and don't require much attention, making them an ideal addition to your space. And remember, if you'd like to choose your own plants to put in a container, our talented designers can create something beautiful for you. Now that we've got all our favorites picked out, I want to remind you of some helpful care tips that I've learned on my houseplant journey. Number one, select plants based on your room's light level. This will help to ensure their success. Number two, choose a good soil and you can find the perfect container mix at English Gardens. Number three, keep potting soil moist but not wet. Too dry or overwatered will damage your plant's roots and could prevent further growth. Number four, remember that a pot with good drainage is key. Be sure to look for a hole in the bottom and don't forget a saucer. Number five, try not to move your plants around too much. Give them the time they need to acclimate to their new surroundings. For products used in this video, check out the description below. Product availability does vary by location and inventory changes frequently. Stop into any English garden store today to find everything you need to style your home with houseplants. Stay tuned for more episodes of Let's Grow. See you later. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe to our channel for more ways to make your life beautiful.